You're scrolling YouTube shorts. You do that for about, let's say 30 minutes. You get bored of that, so you close that out. Well, then you open up TikTok. You do that for about two hours, but you get bored of that also, so you close that up. Then you open up Instagram. Seriously? Instagram? Anyway, you scroll reels for about three hours. Three hours? Really? Okay, this time is starting to add up a little bit. Then you start to get bored of that. Cause you know, the only way to stop being bored of 60 second clips on Instagram is to go ahead and watch 60 second clips on a different platform, right? And lastly, you open Reddit. 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 You know your parents are disappointed in you, right? How exactly do you expect Reddit to be different. I mean, except maybe the fact that there's adult furry content on there, but that's not the point. You know what Reddit is supposed to be for? When you, as a collective, have a weird problem that you need to fix in like tech or something, or recipe sharing, not for mindless scrolling or wanking. That's what Twitter is for, like a respectable individual culture. Mindless scrolling. Oh, buddy, you better believe that there's a word for it. And that word is doom scrolling. The definition of doom scrolling and or doom surfing is to be constantly looking at sad and depressing news on social media. Now, this is the official meaning of doom scrolling colloquially, colloquially, collo colloquially, 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 colloquially. While that's the official definition of doom scrolling, colloquially, it essentially means to just endlessly and mindlessly scroll social media with no end goal, just to sort of something to do. I get it right and the green screen falls down, son of a bitch. I'm not, I'm not redoing that take. Here's the thing, you're not accomplishing anything either. You're just sitting there on the couch like the lard you are, giving the occasional giggle to anything remotely funny or relatable. <laughs> it's so funny and relatable. Now, I do not have any issue with the way someone decides to spend their free time, but really? And on top of that, you're consuming your content in nine by 16, arguably one of the worst aspect ratios for depth. Now, I don't think the creators of House MD intended for you to watch the clips like that. Like, what? What? Why is it all, why is it all zoomed in? No, do this. That's, that's much better. I, is it really that hard to do this? We are definitely not living in the future that filmmakers pushed for, that's for sure. Do you think they intended for you to watch shit like that? No. No. They were hoping for the widest possible aspect ratio that you could have, hell, if they would do 360. What happened to 360 video? It's cool, people like 360 video. And yes, for certain topics, I think it's great to have certain information be condensed and straight to the point, but I think we can all agree that some things just take longer than 60 seconds to learn. I really don't subscribe to the idea that you can master CPR in 60 seconds, nor learn the basic principles of philosophy. That took Diogenes his entire life, and he ended up living naked in a pickle barrel, or, or a tub drinking water from the street out of a bowl. And on top of that, he saw a kid drinking water from the street, dirty water, using his ha his hands instead of a bowl. So he's just like, what the fuck do I need this bitch ass bowl for? I think that happened. I don't know, I didn't look it up. I was too busy watching shorts. I mean, it's not like these platforms are doing you any favors. Doom scrolling is only beneficial to them because they got you to look at their site for longer and they can serve you more ads and more stuff. That's their, they can sell you things. How does this fucking idiot expect me to watch this with no subway surfer footage? Because really quickly, they figured out that they don't need you to watch the four hour video essay. You will just scroll on one minute videos for four hours. It doesn't matter who you watch or what you watch as long as you don't leave the website. Would you rather watch one four hour video or would you rather watch one minute videos for four hours. It's genius, cause fuck retention, right? Ooh, ooh, ah, ah, funny monkey brain like stimulation. That's good dopamines, that's like 20 dopamines. That's chimp, you see that? He can only do like seven dopamines max. Our ancestors, they four dopamines at best. It's not a lot of dopamine. So it makes sense why these shorts are so popular. Or reels, TikToks. But I mean, come on, if you just stick around longer than a minute, there's way better content and stuff that you could be watching. Like a whole 134, 45 minute long episodes of Shameless. Well, there you go. Then your viewership now serves a purpose better than serving an algorithm. You're experiencing a complicated story. Is it a very good story? Yeah, well, it's shameless, so only sorta, kinda. But you still care about the characters and continuity. You think a Mr. Beast shorts video offers you those things? And I know that for a fact, cause you can't name every giveaway. Do it right now, name every shop Mr. Beast product. <laughs> I thought so. 
fake fan. You f Listen, I'm not shaming you for doom scrolling. I mean, I do it too. It causes me to not write videos and not edit. It's just overall a waste of time. Oh, but you can just have more self-control. Okay, then do it. I can't do it. It seems that you're not doing it, so what's the problem here? Exactly, it's a wake-up call because you won't wake yourself up and I won't wake myself up. So here we are because none of us have the self-control or the self-respect. I certainly don't. Oh well, Ando, the only doom scrolling I do is on eBay. Well, that's not doom scrolling, that's a shopping addiction, but that's a whole different thing. According to the US government, that's completely okay. It's fine, it helps the economy or whatever. One societal issue that actually matters at a time. I I'm not saying the other societal issues don't, uh, but I live in California. We've been allowed to consider ourselves better since the Jerry Brown administration, let's just face it, okay? We've got the restrooms and the plant-based restaurants to prove it, okay, buddy? Listen, there's nothing wrong with enjoying a little bit of reels and 60-second content, but everything in moderation, okay? But when you've even got j boomers and people in Gen X saying that that's all they do all day is just something to do, you know that there's a problem there and it affects all of us. It's, it's all good, man. In conclusion, just, just be careful. Limit your screen time. Let's say um, eight hours regular screen time and then one hour a day garbage shorts trash brain screen time. Try to create that strict schedule if you can. I know it can be difficult. Okay, I'm bored with all that. Like if you like, bell icon if you bell icon. Flip. I've got more in the Flip. pipeline coming, so ding, uh, ding. Just, thank you. And uh, just remember, um, doom scribe. Yeah, that's right. I asked you to subscribe twice. Fuck you. I don't care. Haha. <laughs>